up? So I am out for a little bit of a ride today in Richmond and uh, seeing some really cool things out there on my trip. Uh, definitely post a video about that so you can kind of get an idea of some of the things that are out here to see and places to cruise, cool areas in the state capital for Virginia. So before I left the house today, I got a package in. It's from Land and Surf. Thanks for my pint. And I have been waiting for these for a long time. I am glad that I got them because on the way down here to Stone, riding through Richmond, there was a ton of hills coming downhill. So now I gotta turn around and head back up. And I'm thinking that these are really gonna help in the case of a potential nosedive as I'm kind of climbing up those hills to go back to my car. So let's open this up and uh, see what's inside, get it put together, then get it put on the board. So it looks like in the package I've got some directions, installation, contents of the kit, got some hardware, stickers, sweet, and then this bumper that these are going to go into. So this bumper is awesome, man. This thing looks and feels just like the uh, future motion version of the bumper. That's awesome. Yeah. Pretty sweet. All right, cool. Let's check out these instructions and get these wheels installed so I can get it on the board. So we've got these little screws in here, screwed in, pulls the wheel on. That wheel doesn't quite roll as well as this one does. This one here free spins nicely. Now let's try to loosen this up a little bit, see if that helps. Yeah, there we go, now it rolls a little better. Perfect. All right, so that is the install on the bumper. Now uh, let's get the bumper on the board. All right, space is a bit limited here, so uh, you're gonna get a close-up view of this install. All right, here we go. Let's take these screws out and uh, get this new bumper in.
All right, so I've got the install done for the most part, but the holes for this, these two bolts did not line up well. So uh, I think I'm gonna have to maybe drill out that hole a little bit. I don't have equipment and stuff like that here to do it on site. So uh, I'm gonna try to ride it without those two in there for the next leg of this trip. So I guess we'll see how that does. I'll stop in a little bit and check it, just to make sure everything's okay. But um, this is the install. So you see it very flush to the board, very sleek. Uh, I like the look, you know, the fit. A little bit of a challenge but uh, you know it's tough to make sure all those tolerances are right and stuff like that so anyway we'll get out there and try to rip on this thing and uh, see what we can do